making chili. All right, so behind the scenes, here we are. Uh, still at this Nextville County Fair. It is yeah. Wednesday, um, and it's raining. So it is, let's check the time, 6 o'clock. So I have a magic show at 7 with Agra Dabra. Uh, and this is what it looks like outside. So not much is going to happen. Uh, very few people out. And what do you do on a rainy day? You sit in the RV watching TV. Uh, did some ironing earlier, went through some magic tricks. Uh, still haven't put all the crap away from Walmart. Uh, sitting with the rabbit. Just chilling down there. But that's uh, pretty much it. You sit here and watch TV most of the day. Episode 2 is up, so that's up and going. So uh, we're sitting here on a little rainy day. Uh, we will attempt to do this show because I do have a stage here. So we'll go out there and turn music on. I don't think anybody's going to sit in the rain. And like I said, there's very few people here. So the people who are here, whenever it does stop raining for a little bit, they're going to jump on the rides. Uh, and then we'll see what happens with the Hypno Show at 8.45. See you later. Nice rainy day. Alright guys, 7 minutes till showtime. We're here at Snacksville getting ready for the first Agri Driver Magic Show of the day. And... Yep. Started raining again. That's right. Just coming down like crazy. So, what can we say? Show will probably be canceled. And uh, go back to watching TV. All right, guys, we're off on one of our excursions with Jim here from the Snexville County Fair. We're going to it's Tanner's, right? Tanner's Sports Center. Tanner's Sports Center is a really cool gun store. Uh, follow them on Facebook and stuff. Uh, they also have a lot of really cool specials, special ammo and stuff like that. So uh, we are cruising down the road. We will show you some stuff from the gun store. And if we're lucky, we might go shooting after a while. We are planning on shooting on Saturday. We're doing those play shooting, so we'll get that on there for you. But uh, one day at the fair, we're just off and going. The fair doesn't open until 5 o'clock. Shows are at 7 or 9, so what better do? Let's go to the gun store. The only person who's terrified by this is my wife, because she's afraid I'm going to spend money right now. <laughs> That's a good chance. Mm -hmm. okay. um, no, Nobody's on them. For some reason, I'm not to the middle slot. I can pull it three times. It's all hundred bucks. I ran out of there like. Well, I told you we were going to Tanner's to a gun store, so we did. It's a nice place to get a chance. Where, where are we at here in Pennsylvania? Jameson, Pennsylvania. So we're just outside Philly, right? Yeah. Feel like North. What? Doyle's Town area. Very nice place, and yes, I got a new gun. So uh, we'll exp explain this to the wife later. But yep, 12 gauge. So hey, ready to go hunting with somebody. Uh, Grayson might have a 12 gauge now. But get a chance to come by and see the place. So it's pretty cool. All right, so here's the thing. It's uh, about 40 minutes till showtime. Uh, sorry, I got people starting to sit down and get ready. But uh. That is getting bigger. It's going that way, but it's coming this way a little bit too. And the radar is showing big rain. It's just you can't tell if it's going to hit or miss us. So, um, as a performer, this is one of the things you're trying to figure out because uh, that some pretty big clouds, and it's looking like it might start moving this way a little bit. So it's coming up this way, but uh. These are the things you try to figure out before the show, before you put all the recording equipment out and all that type of stuff, because we've got TVs, recording equipment, and it's just starting to sprinkle. So we'll see what happens. Last night, they actually had ponchos on for the show. Some guy brought ponchos. We did a whole show throughout the whole rain, right whenever I got people under, started raining. We did a full show, because everybody in the audience stayed with ponchos. Everybody on stage was dry, so we were good to go. So we'll see what happens tonight. So we're here at Levi, Lee, High Valley uh, shooting place. So this place is pretty cool. So, turn around with us today.
So like I said, we're at this shooting range. It's actually a clay shooting place and you can see all the clays, all the shotgun shells that have been shot. So the clays are gonna come from over that way this time. They're gonna come toward us. So I'll try to set it so you can see it. So as you can see, this is a pretty cool spot. Just like a golf course, like you're on a country club. Except for guns and shells, no clubs. Pretty cool. These things on the bottom are called vinyls. They do the exact same thing. The only reason I can find that we call them vinyls is well, because they eat vinyl. <laughs> if I give them a little vinyl right there. <laughs> Sorry, that was me. <laughs> actually, actually, they have these things here on the bottom. These are called spurs. If you've ever been chased by a chicken, this is what they're called. Ah, slacks. Oh, wait, 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 Alright guys, so uh, this next little fair is over with. We've packed up. We are on the road heading toward the Big Butler Fair, which is just north of Pittsburgh. Uh, so this is Sunday. We're driving from Snexville to Big Butler with the RV. It's in tow. Yep, still there. Uh, we'll drop it tonight, spend the night there. Our 350 truck is still not fixed, so I have to drive to Richmond on Monday pick up the puppet show we'll drop back here on all right so behind the scenes all the fun stuff yep that's right here it is it's a blowout so we gotta roll it up so I can get high enough to get chalks up and under it if we get lifted up and off so a little behind the fun scenes blowout Alright guys, so here we are, we're getting ready to pull into Butler, uh, had a flat tire on the way here, finally found a Walmart, got a new tire put on, so we have a spare again, so we had to go about, not 50, 60 miles with no spare, but uh, pulling into the grounds now, power's midway is starting to set up, so we're going to pull up here and Pulled into our spot. I'll show you that here. So that's the ground right there. 
this is Sunday. We're pulling on Sunday. The fair doesn't start till Friday. If I decide to make a trip all the way back home, pick up the puppet trailer and come back here, like I was saying earlier, we got all types of stuff going on there. Oh, but here we are pulling in. Made it, just took a little extra long. So we're gonna get everything parked. The back of our stage. See you later. All right guys, so here's the update. We uh, made it back from Butler to Richmond to pick up the puppet trailer. Uh, we're having to stay because of a funeral for my mother-in-law. On top of that, I had a pothole or a manhole cover, which broke the manifold on my new 250 truck. So it's being repaired now. The 350 is still trying to be repaired. My wife's car is leaking water. And we have her mother's funeral. And the fair starts on Friday. And it's Tuesday now. And we're still in Richmond. Uh, we'll be here tomorrow. Hopefully the truck will get fixed tomorrow while the funeral's going on. And then we will hopefully get on the road Wednesday afternoon sometime. Get back to Butler Wednesday night. Set up on Thursday. So I had to set the puppet show, puppet car, magic show, and hypno show all day Thursday to be ready to open on Friday. So uh, we're just hanging with the chickens now. Waiting for trucks to be fixed. Funeral stuff. We got family in town. And for you guys who know, I am a social butterfly. So this is fantastic. <laughs> we will see you guys on the road. Hope you've enjoyed this episode of Behind the Scenes. Um, the blowout. The uh, parts of the show for you. Uh, it's been a fun day. See ya. <laughs>